Good morning. This is Pastor Vince with your Daily Manna for February 13th. Your word for today comes from Matthew 24, verses 37 through 39, from the King James Version of the Bible. The word says, But as the days of Noah were, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. For as in the days that were before the flood, they were eating and drinking, marrying and giving in marriage, until the day that Noah entered into the ark, and knew not until the flood came and took them all away, so shall also the coming of the Son of Man be. Again, that's Matthew 24, 37 through 39, from the King James Version of the Bible. Friend, uh, just as the word says, as it was in the days of Noah, so shall the coming of the Son of Man be. Jesus is coming soon. I'm sure you know that by now. And as the old expression goes, if you don't know, now you know. Jesus is coming soon. As it was in the days of Noah, there was a lot of, uh, you know, wickedness going on, people doing their own thing. You know, they didn't have time for God. You know, a lot of evil happening. And we know the conversation that God had with Noah. Noah had 120 years. Now, let me just explain. And I'm sure you've heard other pastors, other preachers, other uh, teachers explain this as well. The Bible does not exactly say in these exact words that Noah preached 120 years. It doesn't say that in those exact words. I'm using those exact words. But Noah, for 120 years, he sounded the alarm. He let the people know that, hey, destruction's coming. You know, turn away from your evil ways, etc. And we know the rest of the story. The flood did come. And I don't need to get more into that. So as it was in the days of Noah, so shall also the, the coming of the Son of Man be. Jesus is coming soon. Destruction is coming. Just like in the days of Noah, there's a lot of wickedness going on in the world today. A lot of things happening. I won't get into all the details. You know what's going on. We all know what's going on. And God has given all of us time to get it right, to get it together, because destruction is coming. We don't know if we have 120 years. We don't know how much time we have. But destruction is coming. So God has given us the warning. He is sending modern-day Noah's to let people know to get it together because destruction is coming, not next time by, well, by water, but by fire. So I pray that this will, uh, you know, wake all of us up. I wanted to share this once again. We've uh, read this before. You may have read this before. You've heard this preached before, whatever. But yes, we need to get it together. We all need to get together on some level, in some way. So let this be a warning to all of us, but but also let it be a blessing to hear this word, to know that, you know, God loves us, he cares for us, and he wants us to make things right with him before Jesus comes again. Please join me tomorrow for more of Your Daily Manna. Have a blessed day.